The high school basketball state championships are underway, and the number one team in Northern California hails from San Ramon. It's the Doherty Valley Wildcats, who have risen from a relatively new program to a Bay Area powerhouse. When the final buzzer sounded last Saturday in the North Coast section finals, Doherty Valley had beaten perennial power De La Salle to capture its first ever section championship. And for head coach Mike Hansen, the moment was extra special. I tell every kid who ever played here, every kid who ever played at YV, everyone who's ever coached with me, this was all for them. I mean, this was like, we don't, you know, I ran up to the stands and hugged my dad. Like, I don't get there without the roots that he put in me about this game. Those roots run deep. Hanson is the only men's basketball coach Doherty Valley has ever known. Hired in 2007 when the school first opened. First year we opened the school with only freshmen and sophomores. Played a JV schedule. The next year we had to play a varsity schedule with just juniors. And it was a long year. It was 2-26. and 26. I never thought we'd get here. Um, I leaned on my dad a lot. He'd been through it. Mike has indeed followed in the footsteps of his dad, Tom, who in the early 70s was the first ever basketball coach at Foothill High in Pleasanton. He did the same thing. He opened a school. He got beat up a bunch of years early. He's like, no, you just believe in your culture, believe in your system, and just keep grinding it out, and eventually it'll swing, and it has. Led by Coach Hansen's culture of family, lots of senior leadership, and plenty of depth the Wildcats are 27 and 3. And your 2023 East Bay Athletic League MVP, Connor Sevilla. Doesn't hurt to have star players either. We're a family here, like everyone gets along really well in practice, you know. We have a lot of fun even though we're working hard and going at each other and that helps us a lot on the court. League MVP Connor Sevilla and USF commit Ryan Beasley are arguably the best guard tandem in the Bay Area. But it was another standout player, Blake Hudson, who transferred to the school his senior year, who teammates say may have put the Wildcats over the top. He's been the glue to our team. I think we needed that piece last year. That's why we didn't really get it done. But this year, we've been winning a lot because we got Blake here now. The high-flying Hudson loves the never-give-up attitude of this team, best illustrated by its remarkable comeback last month against San Ramon Valley in the playoffs. In that game against SRV, we were down by, like, I think 27, 30 points at a half, and I think we just fought our way back. So I feel like the way we just stayed together as a team and our resilience is uh, really important to us. What makes them special? Um, just their selflessness. A lot of great teams talk about it, but these guys embody just fighting for each other and being about each other and reveling in each other's success. Three more wins to get, one at a time, starting Saturday night here. Yeah, and Saturday night they're going to play St. Joe's of Santa Maria, who have, has, has a super sophomore player, so it's going to okay. be a battle, but they're playing at, on the campus of Doherty Valley Saturday night, nice. and if they win that, they're on to the final four. Wow, that's exciting. That's so it's exciting. something great. special really going. Yeah, on they're there. they're uh, they're a great team. And that means great party players. at our house right. if they win. <laughs> I know where we're going to be Saturday night. There you go. <laughs>